Taipei's mayor has been accused of interfering in the KMT primary. Li Jingying, one of Ke Wenzhou's closest aides, had written an online post urging the public to unite against Han Guoyi during the KMT's presidential primary. In the wake of the post, Ke's administration has been hit by allegations of meddling in the KMT race. Ke has rejected the accusations, saying that the aide was only expressing a personal view. Fresh from his trip to Shanghai, Taipei's mayor attended a public function today in Taipei. He found himself fielding questions about a close aide who wrote a controversial post on a public forum. The aide called on the public to unite against the Han presidency. The post was seen by some as election meddling by Ke's own presidential campaign. Young people care about major national issues. I can't tell you not to express your opinions. We all have freedom of speech. Ideally, every candidate should be the party's best possible choice for Taiwan's overall interests and long-term development. But what's happening instead is that every party is scheming away. They're thinking, hey, if we nominate this person, that would help our chances in the election. I feel that, ah, this is why our country gets more and more chaotic. Ke stressed that the post only reflected the opinion of his aide. Last week at the Twin Cities Forum, this particular aide had featured in a snafu with the Chinese hosts. During a closed-door meeting with China's Taiwan Affairs Office Chief Liu Jieyi, Ke's team had launched a live stream that was interrupted by the hosts, reportedly due to a miscommunication. Reportedly, that same aide had been one of those who proposed the live stream. We still have to write the evaluation report for that. Usually such mishaps aren't the fault of one person. It's always a product of a confluence of mistakes by many people. The live stream incident and Lee's political post online have stoked controversy for the mayor, creating a fire to put out on his first day back at work.